Coach Joffrey Makwenda is a person who was born in Lusaka from the family of seven. Four boys, three girls, but only the three of us are still surviving now. Yes, I'm a family man. I'm married to Priscilla Hamakwenda. My football journey, I started my football career at Pro Fund Warriors. That was back in 1994. From the under 14, I went through the, all the structures of the NAP Pro Fund Warriors until I was promoted in the senior team. In I joined the Saga Dinos. I played for Saga for three seasons before coming back to Pro Fund Warriors in 2007. As a football player, I think we never won any cup. But I have played with so many players, great players. But in terms of trophies, we didn't win any cup. Apart from winning promotion from uh, Division 1, by then it was Division 1. There was nothing, there was nothing like uh, Eden League. We won Division 2012 I was a coach. When that was my first season as a coach. I was with the youth team, now young Napsasters. Yeah, but very much with the senior team. Every time the senior team were training, I was with them. Even the games, I used to travel with the team. I played different positions from number two up to number six. So I wouldn't say which one was my best position. I started my coaching career at the Napsasters. That was in 20. 2012. I wanted to continue playing, but unfortunately, Coach Ivan Sakar and the late manager Boniface Rupaka uh, persuaded me to go into coaching, and I started coaching the youth. Napsas, young Napsas, that was in 2012. By then, we were in the under 17 league, first under 17 league. That's how I started my coaching career. Well, this is the first time I'm working with Coach Perry, so the experience, experience is good. I cannot complain, it's good. It has been good because his training most of the time they are tactical trainings. Simple but tactical. The experience I would say it has been good and tough at the same time. Good in the sense that we managed to win promotion to the Super League and tough in the sense that we have been fighting with a lot of things. Supporters from other teams and the Playing services, they're not up to standards. It hasn't been easy. People must think it was just a walk in the park, but it hasn't been easy. But it's good that we have won promotion back to the Super League. It's historical. I think it even be with the Coach Pedro and Coach Sipo. Because we won it in 2012. By then, that's when I was just starting my coaching career and I was with them when they won the trophy. But winning it, as a, winning it as a coach, I don't know how I can explain it. Because most coaches have coached their teams, have stopped coaching without winning the battles. But for me to win it, I just give glory to God. It, it hasn't been easy, but it's all glory to God. And this time, Napsos has a sponsorship. By then, when it was it used to be called uh, Pro Fund Warriors, we lost sponsorship. It was we're only surviving on a grant. But nowadays, this time, yeah, they, are, they have the, all the sponsorship, so players are putting in enough. It's just about motivating them or pushing them at training. Expectations are high, and I believe we'll do well, because it's just about planning. We start to plan early, nothing is impossible. I think we just have to recruit more players and have the depth in the team. What happened last season is like we considered much on the Continental and completely forgot about the league. So we didn't have the depth in the team. So it's all about eh, having the depth in the team, then such things won't happen again. Uh, this, to the sponsors, I say thank you so much for the sponsorship and the fans, thank you for, so much for your support.